don't starve would be a magnificent option, I would say. Right, this stuff is great. Just watch this. Boing! It makes you bounce. It makes whatever hits it bounce. So, I think we need to go up there. Okay, that gets the door open. Which means there's probably a button somewhere. That's over there. Okay, alright. And that drops a cube. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. Yes, uh, Dragon Ball Tamer's favorite phrase. Right, now we can get out of here. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre recorded messages. I pay the bills here, I can talk about the control group all damn day. <laughs> just jump and boing. For oh, okay, what if you insist? Problem is, it's actually a bit boring this stuff because there's not really much of a a place to bounce other than backwards and forwards. It's like playing table tennis with shell. Let's move on. Cubes bouncing Minecraft. <laughs> yes, I think Dragon Ball Tamer started to draw at that statement. To be honest with you, mm, bouncing cubes. Right. I'm willing to bet we need a portal there, but where do we put the other one? I play too much Minecraft. I press shift in order to uh creep. Ah. No. Where's the way out of here? Okay, it wasn't that way. Next test chamber that way, which is probably meant to be a cl Oh, yes, it's a very big clue. There you go. Right, so, put one there. Step through. Whee! Yeah, I've got to be honest with you, they got they hit the nail right on the head with this dialogue. It's absolutely brilliant. Uh, that's a rather look at these things I don't know if you guys have ever seen these as teletype machines okay they're utter pain to use utter utter pain make it spider solitaire <laughs> um, how about the mad pack of crazy craft no I've not played those ones um, any good well you wouldn't be recommending them otherwise, would you? I'm well, assuming you're recommending them. Nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. <laughs> Okay, so there's a cube over there. In order to bounce up onto that. Let's do the simple one first. And we the bet we're gonna to want to go boink. Yep. That was the easy one. Uh, hey, all right, and there's a a button there. Have cube, C button. I can guess what they want us to do with this. Okay, and that's given. Oh, I see what this is giving us. All right. 
Too bad Ellen doesn't have any. Mm. Will you step through these quantum tunnels with me? Yeah, I can just see that actually. Alright. Bounce boy. Okay. Button there. Okay, we're gonna need a cube for that, aren't we? And there's a cube over there. And I wonder. Nope, not like that. Like that. How's that for bouncy, 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 eh? Yes. Yeah, I totally agree with that. There we go. Right, that's given us that one. And... Right, what do we want with this? Okay, so we put one there. Put one there. That should get us through. In the exits. There we go. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion <laughs> gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. I don't need a portal gun to be right behind you. Yes. <laughs> oh, perhaps they can give us a quantum tunneling straw. All these science fears are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. <laughs> Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, I can read it, but it's so much better when he says it. <laughs> Take care, Andy. See you soon. Right. Caution. Do not lean on railing. Yeah. Possibly the best advice I've had all year. Okay, so... I'm willing to bet the large sign that says exit is near our goal. We've got various bits of white paint here. Putting one up there. I should imagine that we're going to have to catapult ourselves up there. Oh, there's a big one there. Uh, we need to find a way of catapulting ourselves by the looks of it. And preferably in such a way that doesn't actually land us in the water there. Okay, so... Got that there. We do have this here. Do we have anywhere to fall into? We don't really, do we? But... Uh-huh. We have a little platform up there which might be important. <laughs> Best way to fall to the ground going, ah. <laughs> I have three walking with mods packs in Crady Cat and the Sky Island Challenge. Um, 
played Sky Island, and that's a, a very, very good challenge. Is there something up there? There is something up there. Let's see what that says. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. I think that's where we want to go. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. Isn't he such a wonderful person, eh? Isn't he such a little darling? Right, we have a blue goo dispenser there. And it leads through to this button. We need to decide where to put the blue goo to be of maximum use, or just some use, which probably needs to be... Put it here, see if we can just bounce up. Yeah, that worked. Put another bomb there. Well, that worked too uh, so far. Oh, okay. We want to get up there now. Can we use this one? No, we can't. Okay. Oh, there's a platform there. Right. That do it. Yeah, that'll do it. Okay. Right. Let's get up there. Let's get up there the right way. Point. Okay, and then no. Oh, oh, that might have actually helped us. Let's try that. See you, twin. Davian, save the turrets. Yes, collect a whole set. They're worth a fortune. Okay, that's... Okay, that's giving us another bit. Is that enough? Yep, that is enough. Okay, so if we put... Something like that. And... Okay, right, we need a bounce there. So let's put... That one there. And yet yeah, that's created a bouncy bit there. So let's get... Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, oh, absolutely. Don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Oh, I think Damon would definitely like a purple turret. Perhaps, you know, a few jewels, perhaps a little bit of fur, but... Yeah, anything that I pick is going to be absolutely fabulous. So, this is repulsion gel, guys. What do you think of it? Who's this? Oh, let's got to scroll back here. Dark Green Goddess. Now, if only we had a giant. Oh, did you see you're somebody starting to talk about honeypots? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right. Hmm. 
1958 this one now, test, if you're test. part of control group Kepler 7 we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull most likely you've forgotten it's even there but if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test let us know because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast tiny microchip about the size of a postcard hey Alright, that's water, am I understanding? That is gel. Um, water washes away gel. We have a button up there. We have... Well, it's pretty much just a button up there, isn't it? Um, Okay, that's not much help, but perhaps doing it this way might be. Yeah, that's a help. Okay. Right. Need to get up there and push that button. That will probably help. did that do? Whatever it did, it did it over there. So we now need to get up there. Oh, it turned the water off. Ah ha ha! It turned the water... Oh, all right. I think I'm starting to understand this now. Right, we put an orange one there. Yeah, okay, but that's, that's blocked by the water. So we turn the water off. We can then bounce up here. Hey, hey simple as that. I'm telling them, keep your pants on. <laughs> Alright, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. Absolutely. Okay, so that works. Uh, we go up here. Aha! Right, okay. We bounce. And through! Did we miss anything there? No, we didn't. A bit late to the game, hello! Mm. They are they are implanting microchips the size uh, in people's hands, but they tend not to be the size of a postcard. That I've got to be honest with you is slightly disturbing. He says, thinking it's incredibly disturbing. That said, I remember the size of the first um, Pentium chips, and um, they were they were absolutely massive. They were sort of two or three inches on the side. Okay, what do we want to do here? Uh, well, it's fairly easy to get over there, but is that any use to us? Can we get up there? We can't get up there. We have... that spot there. So, right, we can jump down here and that will give us some momentum coming out of somewhere, but we need to work out where we can go. We can go up. If we put a portal there and a portal up there, we'll end up on that ledge, but where do we go from there? Let's find out, shall we? That's F6, just in case this is a stupid idea. shows us another area but is this a good idea or not let's see if we can work that out 
We can't get through there because we don't know how to duck. Okay, so it would be nice if we could get up there somewhere. Do we see anywhere up there to go? Yes, Gurdy Simmers, always welcome for some custom content. Um, please feel free to send me the links, email them, put them in a comment somewhere. Um, Twitch is probably the best thing. Not Twitch, sorry, Twitter is probably the best thing. Uh, right, let's see, we'll work out where I need to go here. Uh, I mean, ideally, it would be over there somewhere, wouldn't it? Uh, Okay, let's just reload that a second. And let's just see if I've missed something. Don't think I have. No, I don't think I have at all. And there's there's blue drill dropping down there, but I can't actually get to it. I don't think that's actually a part of the game. Just there for graphical purposes. Uh There's a white board up there, and still fairly certain that's where I need to be is up there, but I just couldn't see where to go from it. Is there anything at all up there I can get? No, there isn't. All right, let's go back up there. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether I'm stuck here up here in the complete the wrong place or not is uh, another question. And I'm starting to think I am stuck up here for no particular reason. Um, I personally have no problems with you posting relevant links as long as you're not being spammy. Um, if you are spammy or you're posting something irrelevant, then Sergeant Major Shizzy will tell you off. And um, that's... No, that was not it. Yes, I'm down to the random firing at bits pace. So, right, I'm fairly certain I'm not supposed to be here. Let's try something. Okay, let's go there and just look out. Uh, just look at. Oh, okay, so I can just get back there. That's all right. Okay, so I can get back up here. That's the test we were in. I can't do anything because of this nullification field. Okay. I went to see custom content shopping for about two or three days. Um, if you guys saw the live stream when I created um, uh, Luna Gravina, Damien's real sister, um, basically stuff for her. She's a, a sort of rebellious goth girl type thing who's blue for obvious reasons. But unlike Damien, she's not evil. Evil. Ah, uh, where do I want to go? Where do I want to go? Where... Do we go from here? That's no help. How do we get up there? Any way to get up there? Not really, is there? Let's see, that's, that's our final destination up there. That's the lift out of here, so we need to get in here just to get out there. I should imagine there's one more test involved. 